justice that has led to change. That's how Sandra Bland's mother describes the $1.9 million settlement, settlement rather, in a wrongful death lawsuit. And as CBS 2 Suzanne Lemonio reports, her mother says it's not the money that matters most. Now that means that some mother, some family, some father, somewhere may not have to experience what your daughter did, what your son did while they were in custody. Geneva Reed Veal speaks of the changes in Waller County jail procedures after this. Wow. Get out of the car. Ready for a failure to signal. This video of Reed Veal's daughter, Sandra Bland, went viral. It shows Bland following a traffic stop in Waller County, Texas. Bland was arrested. She would be found dead in her jail cell three days later. An autopsy says the cause was suicide. Bland's family has maintained that could never be true. The $1.9 million wrongful death settlement calls for jail screening education, a nurse or emergency medical technician for all shifts, and inmate checks every 60 minutes. In Bland's case, nearly two hours passed before she was last seen in her cell alive by a guard. Electronic sensors are going to make sure that those checks are made on time. Yes, yes. And the joy with that is there is no room for handwriting. There is no room for pre-writing information. There's no room for falsification. In some sense, at least they've acknowledged what they need to do in the future, and there is some commendation that might and should be directed to their attention. Waller County issued a statement saying a potential settlement has been reached, but it's not yet final, adding both sides agreed to keep details confidential until that happened. The potential settlement is also, they say, not an admission of fault or wrongdoing. Live in the newsroom, Suzanne Lemonio, CBS 2 News, Erica. Okay, Suzanne, thank you.